holy shit hello <laughs> so it's very dark and i'm being kind of quiet because my daughter is asleep behind me but i haven't uploaded in so long <gasps> i broke my tooth well my daughter hit it and it got chipped and then it all broke whenever i've been to a piece of pizza but <laughs> holy shit hi guys so welcome to my channel <laughs> i haven't said that in so long i haven't said that in so freaking long <laughs> like honestly at this point it's kind of like a crime <laughs> i just wanted to get on here and talk to you guys and let you guys know what the fuck i've been doing because i've just been gone <laughs> Um, I finally, like, I'm on TikTok and stuff, like, I'm not, like, gone. Um, I finally decided to just say screw it and dive right in to making my small business. I was like, why not? I've been wanting to. I've been like, well, what if I do this? Well, what if I do this? I finally figured out, like, exactly what I want to do with myself. And I'm kind of excited for you guys to find out, too, because it's... I mean, like, it's everywhere already. I've been talking about it already, but it's like I haven't published a video on YouTube in so long and just sat down and talked to you guys. And I'm so sorry for the angle. It's on my desk. Hang on. There we go. Okay, so, hi. I have been on a journey. There's been a lot of stuff going on in my life and, like, good and bad. And it's just, like, all of it's been happening and I've been moving and I've moved again if you can't tell i'm not in the house that i was in the last video that i've uploaded i'm not in a closet either like i'm in my, my room but um i just wanted to get on here and tell you guys what what i've been doing so i made a business it's called witchy pyre productions um it's because like my i love vampirism and the ideology behind it and i'm a practicing witch and i was just like witchy pyre <laughs> it took a little bit for the name because i was just like Witch amp, witch empire, vampire, bitch, vampire. <laughs> that one still kills me, but I finally figured out I mean, like witchy fire. Um, because it is a combination and it is mean, like its own way. And um, after I get better at working with computers and stuff, I'm actually gonna combine it all, not just on Etsy, but like everything together, like my book. Which, by the way, guys, if y'all didn't know, I published a book, and it's about. A girl struggling with depression and anorexia and anxiety and self-harm and it just basically is her way of getting through it and just defeating it and it's obviously it's like me but <laughs> I published that a while back actually and so if you guys didn't know that like please do not hesitate to ask me in the comments down below like like look in the last I'm not gonna spoil the last page but the last page is literally three letters like, and it starts with like three words and it starts with I'm sorry so but oh apart from that I'm gonna make a website eventually where everything's together and it's gonna be witchypyreproductions.com it's not up yet so don't go searching because I don't know if anybody has that or what um so I'm just gonna dive into what witchy pyre currently offers besides my book so I make spell jars um <laughs> Quite a few kinds, actually. Hang on, let me see if I can. I don't even think I can. Oh my gosh. So it started off as one. <laughs> and now I have so many. So this one's launching tomorrow. But here's what it looks like. I posted a little teaser online already, but. And obviously, it's got a mini. You know, I've got a little mini. Little mini. That one is a surprise, so stay tuned. Um. Then I've got the anxiety, anxiety Kicker. Now these are made to order, like obviously I have to make some for pictures and stuff. So I've got my Anxiety Kicker in the large. There she is, so we don't want to do that. It's my mini Anxiety Kicker. Um, my large self-love self jar, you know, just give yourself a little self-love. Or if you want to give yourself just a little self-love, we got a mini, of course. And then we have the protection jars. So I offer protection jars in this size and in this size. Um, but currently my other one is in my purse way over there. So I don't want to go up there and grab it because I'm finally sitting here talking to you guys. So let me see. Don't mind the angle change. Just want to show you guys something. I have a ridiculous amount of backstock for these jars. 
So I've got, and then these jars which hold my um, moon sugar, but that, but that's that's in a little bit. That's not. That's still in production. I'm not ready to work with that just yet. That'll probably be like a later date thing, like a lift scrub or something. Um, so then I've got even more jars. I've got to pick up more big jars soon. That's the anxiety kicker jar. I gotta pick up some soon. So. So that is that, like that's what I've really been working on, you know, and I've been like getting packaging and stuff like that so I can start shipping these out because I ship these everywhere. Like, psh. and if you order them, I'm gonna start really working on my brand because my cousin ordered one and I sent her one and I didn't get to send it the way that I wanted to send it because I had no idea what I was doing and I took it up to the post office and I was just like, I was just like, hang on, I was like, I was like, I need to send one of these, please. When I tell you that lady looked at me like I was the fucking sociopath, she was like, and what is it? <laughs> I was like, it's a self-love jar. <laughs> and she was like, oh, okay, yeah. So yeah, I just, I've been working on those and I've been getting like all natural ingredients, you know, to keep everything natural. And I charge each jar that I work with, you know, with the spell that way. It's like no effort on your half. You just get it and it works, you know, and you just focus on it like every day. And, you know, you just bask in yourself and you really need to like, I realized something over this past year. People realize, people need to realize that like we are all human beings and we all need to love each other and surround each other with good energy because if not, it's just gonna deteriorate ourselves and drag ourselves down and yeah, I um, mainly started these little jars, these little spell jars, because it's just something that I really wanted to be able to help people with. And I know that sounds so weird, but I believe in it 100%. And that's that. I um, got contacted through Facebook by a woman to come and decorate some of her jars. And I didn't make them like full spell jars because that's not what she had requested. But I did, you know, put good energies into the jars as I was making them because I want her little... I want her little salon area to do great and I want her to be able to like thrive and love what she does and never have the struggle of not knowing if she loves it. So yeah, I did put a few little spell pieces to that, but, and she gets that Monday and I am so excited for her. <laughs> anyway, if any of you have like a small business, please do not hesitate to find me because I am freaking out over how creative everybody is and i'm over here like i make spell jars and then everyone was over here like i make this and i'm like i love this so <laughs> that was the most insane thing i've ever done on camera <laughs> no i'm lying mr squiggly poof was the most insane thing i've ever done on camera that was on my old youtube channel and that was a <laughs> <laughs> So anyway, now to like the part where I don't think a lot of people are going to stay around for. Hi, it's been a while. I miss you guys. I miss doing videos. I've been doing a lot. <laughs> and I've been trying to do some like self-discovery and some research as I go. And I've been trying to read a lot of books and just absorb as much thought and stuff that I can. And it is pretty crazy. And then, you know, I just, it's just been a lot going on. And this is just... The best experience so far everyone's like how is how is it running your own small business and i was like well i've made one order but it's great because other than that i've been getting a lot of like really good response from like online from friends and family they're like i love well i've made actually two orders because my sister bought a self-love jar and i hyped that shit up i was like i was sitting there making it and i was like you will love yourself no, not really, but you know, I was just, you know, I, I really put a lot of effort into these jars and I'm like, I really hope they do well because if they do well, that means you guys are going to be doing well because, you know, self-love and anti-anxiety and a lot of people have anxiety, which really sucks because, you know, anxiety fucking sucks. <laughs> anyway, I'm going to go and try and get some rest because my kid's been asleep for a little bit and I worked on... This one, this new baby, look at that. I love the way that does that. The only sad part is like that during shipping probably would not survive, but I love the way that does that. But I worked on making this jar along with its mini. So I'm gonna get some rest now.
I love you guys. Don't forget to subscribe if you're not already subscribed. This is video. Blah, 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 blah. Give this video a big thumbs up if you were excited and you want to check it out. Don't hesitate to ask any questions, comments, concerns, suggestions. I will be here. Love you guys. Be sure to subscribe if you're not already subscribed. Give this video a big thumbs up and I will talk to you in a future time. Hopefully less time will be between this one and the next one versus this one and the past one.